Barbara Bush tragically passed away on April 17 at the age of 92, according to a statement from her family. This shocking development comes shortly after the former First Lady's family announced that she declined to receive further medical intervention after a long illness. She announced she would instead be focusing on comfort care. She passed away at her home in Houston, where she had been since leaving the hospital on April 15 to be surrounded by a family she adores. Barbara is only the second woman in history to be both the wife of a president, George H.W. Bush, and the mother of one as well with George W. Bush. The First Lady's health had been in decline since January 2017 when she was admitted to the hospital after experiencing fatigue and coughing. Her husband, former President George H. W. Bush, was also hospitalized four days prior, arriving to receive care for shortness of breath on January 14. Family and well-wishers were hopeful that the couple were on the mend after they appeared at the 2017 Super Bowl. But Barbara's health took a turn for the worse in the months since. Barbara leaves behind a powerful legacy. Having served as First Lady of the United States from 1989 to 1993, while her husband served as the 41st President of the United States. George and Barbara celebrated their 73rd wedding anniversary on January 6 and the couple still holds the record for the longest married presidential pair. They wed in 1945 and Barbara previously shared how she tied the knot with the first man she ever kissed. She will definitely be missed by her loved ones, as she is survived by her husband, kids George W. Bush, Jeb Bush, Neil Bush, Dorothy Bush Koch, Marvin Bush, her grandchildren, and her great-grandchildren. Barbara is only the second woman in history to be both the wife of a president and the mother of one as well. As First Lady, Barbara championed literacy as one of her primary causes. Founding the Barbara Bush Foundation for Family Literacy in 1989, she believed that fighting illiteracy could help change other social issues, including homelessness and teen pregnancy. She was known for her wicked and often self-depreciating sense of humor and was one of our most beloved first ladies in the modern age. She will be greatly missed.